he has wonderful life. That's the God I'm serving. He's alive today. I don't serve no dead God, guys. I don't know about you, but I don't serve no dead God. I serve a God who's alive, who's active. His word is like a double-edged sword and he cuts. It's not in the bottle. Redemption is not in how many yoga exercises you can do. Freedom, peace is not in all of those things. It is in a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful king who's called Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. All have fallen short. All have fallen short. All have sinned. But because Jesus is so good, because he loves you so much, he died for you. I just want to let you know that giving your life to Jesus isn't hard at all, guys. Giving your life to Jesus looks like you saying, one God, I understand and see that, okay, yes, I am a sinner. I've fallen short of your grace. Two, would you forgive me for my sins right now, right here? And would your Holy Spirit come and dwell in me? Three, let's live a life out together, Lord, and let it be a beautiful adventure of me revealing you to your people and us remaining in fellowship and friendship. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. this land. I pray that the UK would be restored back to you in the name of Jesus. I pray that hearts would turn to you in the name of Jesus. I pray that, oh God, people would recognize that you are Lord. We stamp even this place right now. Let angels be dispatched in this place right now. Let the presence of God unveil right now in the name of Jesus. Even as these wonderful people dance, let them be blessed. Even as people walk through the streets today, let them be blessed. We pray blessing over you. We pray love over you. We pray the power of God over you today in the name of Jesus. I pray for him to break through every stronghold and open your heart for him to know you and you to know him. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Abba. Thank you, Father. Thank you, friend. <laughs>